Hello everyone, welcome to my channel. In today's video, I will discuss on Canadian Resident Matching Service or CARMS. If you find this video helpful, please subscribe to my channel, like this video and turn on the notification bell icon for more videos like this. This means a lot to this channel. Now let's jump into the video. First of all, what is CARMS? It's a national organization that provides matching services for medical residency training throughout Canada. That means this is the portal through which you must apply. The link is in the description below. This video is to familiarize you with CARMS so that you can start preparing well before the application deadline. If you click the link, this will show up. First, you need to register with CARMS and create an account. There is a small amount of fees, but without registering, you still can see a few important points that I want to show here. You can see the first iteration here, which means the first cycle of the matching process. And those who remain unmatched in the first cycle can apply for the second iteration or second cycle. Now, how do you know how many positions are there for each specialty? For that, go on left hand navigation panel and select specialty. For example, we can check internal medicine. Click on internal medicine. You will see a list of all the universities that offer that specialty. You can also check how many positions are there for IMGs. In this way, you can check positions of your preferred specialty. Generally, the fewer positions, the more competitive it is. You can also check the program descriptions, requirements, and documents you need. For that, you need to click on individual university and then you can check the detailed description there. You can also check the timeline such as when the application will open, your letter of reference submitting deadline, and the application deadline. So I would highly encourage to familiarize yourself with CARMS and start preparing, particularly collecting documents. This is because it is possible you may not have all the documents on hand such as your transcript or MSPL. So start collecting those documents early before it is too late. That's all for today. If you have a particular question, please comment down below. Again, please subscribe to my channel, like this video. Thank you so much for watching.